Just gonna do the intro like this. Maybe not. Just. Oi. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a shopping haul, unboxing, opening all this products. Oi, let me just put on the table first. It's very heavy. Oops. Oh, oh. Just why you dropping? Oops. Recently, I've repurchased a lot of things that I like to use in the past and also bought a lot of new products as well. If you're interested, then keep on watching. Let's open all of them. Let's start. First of all, I've um, purchased this makeup remover from brand called Amino, Amino Acid. Is that how to pronounce it? It is a Chinese brand. Oh, okay, sorry. That's the name of the make of this water makeup remover. It's called Amino Acid Extract Makeup Remover. The brand is actually called Sniffy, if I pronounce correctly. Yeah. I never used this brand before. Um, I saw on Taobao, it was highly uh, marked and highly recommended by other people who used this before and the saying was very good makeup remover, gentle to the skin and um, I give a go and I'll let you guys know. By the way, uh, I bought it on sale so you purchase one bottle, you get two. Good value for money. Next one is um, this makeup remover tower that I repurchased. I always buy this one while I'm at home and I normally bring about 10 packs to back to UK. It's a very very good uh, makeup remover tower. It's from, it's a Japanese brand and it's called Bifesta. Here, can you see clearly? Okay, yes. I used this makeup remover for many, many years. It's still one of the best I ever used. I've used many other brands as well, but I still find this one from Remove Makeup Efficiency, gentle to the skin, the quality of the tower itself, and the, the amount of water that contains on each tower. This one still come to the top of my list. And the next one is uh, the little bag here is all from uh, Pony Effect. Uh, you probably guys have seen this brand appeared on my videos before. Pony herself is a Korean beauty artist. She's very very famous and well known globally. So this time I bought a um, cream eyeshadow from her. From her brand come on zoom focus okay and then this is the uh, matte lip boosting primer this one is liquid concealer if you can't see clearly on the camera don't worry I will have all the details in my description box this one is also the concealer, but I just chose two different colors as I don't know which one would work better for me. One is rosy ivory, the other one is natural ivory. I suppose rosy ivory that I can use for under eye area and the other one can just for other places on the face. Let's open the eyeshadow and have a look. The color I've chose is Beloved. You know what we do unboxing videos you always need to have a scissor by the way you probably already can tell this is going to be a long video so grab your drink get a cup of tea cup of coffee or orange juice and grab your snacks and enjoy this is the look of the cream eyeshadow it's very nice it's 
Glass the bottle with her brand at the front and golden colored top. And let's just open this. That's the inside. It is more like a natural orange warm tone based eyeshadow and has a golden shimmer in there. Seems very easy to blend. It's very uh, natural color. Oh, now the light is slightly better. I think it would be good for uh, the base of your eyes. And also, you know, if you do a no makeup makeup day or you want to uh, quick put something on and just go to work or go, go to school, this would be a good color. And especially it would be good for spring, summertime as we will go into springtime soon yeah which means you get daylight longer and you everyone will be in a better mood and then let's open this two concealer okay this is the concealer and this is the color mm, 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 rosy ivory I like the packaging it's a matte bottle itself with a golden lid Let's see the color. Oh, I think it would look nice for under eye area, but it's very natural. It has a little bit of yellow tone um, in there. That to compare with the other one, natural ivory. Which is the same look. On the packaging and let's just see inside and this one is more um normal concealer color as i put this two together this is rosy ivory and this one is natural ivory it's very creamy smooth very easy to blend i try it and let you guys know the next one is um, a foundation. I think this foundation comes with something. Let me just find it the same um, brand. Bear with, bear with. With two samples. I think this one comes with a uh, comes with a beauty sponge. Um, this is from brand Barbara Barbary Barbary. Barbaria, I think that's probably how it pronounced over here. Barbaria? Am I right? It is the matte longwear glow foundation. The reason I bought this is two words attract me that long matte longwear and glow. You know, you would think matte and glow are opposite to each other, but it appeared on one product so i'm actually intrigued to know how is this one turns out so um you know what uh, i think i'm going to do a foundation testing video for this one if you're interested subscribe my channel you know and this one uh, as a, a small gift uh, they give you the branded uh i lost my words it comes with their sponge and then they give you two examples which are their hydrating luminous liquid foundation so it's a small sample and then let's move on to I got uh, I bought another concealer from 3CE this brand Oh, look at the packaging it's quite cute it's look like a little uh, eye cream cube stuff let's see the color um, let me see how how much actually in there 10 ml for a concealer 10 ml will last you forever i think 
I press a little bit too much, but hey. This one seems very hydrating and probably can be used as a foundation. The color is very natural as well. Hmm, very interesting. Then let's move on to some brushes. And this time I bought two concealer brush and this one from uh, Go 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 Here. Is that the brand or is the... Uh, no, it has... By the way, do excuse me as I don't have the original packaging for this. Same as for all other products you see. There is no traditional, you know, the brown box you open that. It is because of my dad who is obsessed of throwing those boxes away. He cannot stand that those boxes are lying in his house. So he just have to get rid of them. So for anyone who enjoying that, you know, you open the brown box in the beginning and take the product out, and that's gonna happen on my videos for a while until I go back to UK probably. So um, bless my dad. I think he's a very, very good thing and bless him opening all the boxes for me. But, but sometimes I don't actually see the product details, but I will go back to the original shop where I purchased it to find out. Um, but this one I think is called Go 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 Here. Go Go Here 270. It is a concealer brush. It just seems very good. Uh, with brush these things you you just have to try there is no much you can actually say on first impression it doesn't matter how good you feel about the brush if it doesn't work on your face it's not good enough and this one is a slightly different shape It's more flat concealer brush and this one is 07 I think there is a name on there lovely kitten And move on to Max. I just need to get all of them together. Make sure they are this. I think. Please do excuse me. I bought a lot of them on sale. Therefore, they come with their gift. They come with their you know promotion products. And so I just want to find all of them for one brand together. I think that is. And this one is a set of a brush and from a brand called Amortos. Amortos. I used the, their um, beauty sponge before, which is really, really good. I quickly show you the one I'm using. Uh, so for example, this one. This I would highly recommend. It is very cheap drugstore price, but very, very good to work with any type of foundations. So hence why I bought a set of brushes from them just to try if they are as good as their beauty uh, sponge. This set is, sorry, I'm, I'm, same time I'm trying to find if there any English name for this. That's the inside. Come with a small card. Oh, this is very, this is very romantic. Uh, that this, that the things they written on the card. Probably good for you to write on your Valentine's card or your wife's birthday's card. You know. It's over here. If you want to do a screenshot, on the card it said, "I love three things in this world: sun." moon and you sun for morning moon for night and you forever okay this is the set of the brush so it is a traditional makeup brush set so you have the big one for um using any powders on your face let me just open into film oh it has the protection cover as well Oh wow! 
Oh my god, it is surprisingly soft. Oh my god. Oh, I can stroke on this forever. This is really good. I am very excited to actually try this full set. I'm just gonna show you a couple of um, smaller brush for eyes. This one is a blending brush. So again, the feel is the same. is very very soft. Try doesn't have fallout. Doesn't have loose hair. So far so good. It seems a very good quality. So I will again try it and uh, let you guys know. As I bought this on sale, therefore um, they sent. They gave me another set of a brush. I think this is just for eyes. Set of eye brushes. I will open and have a look, and then give you a carrier bag for for putting all the brushes in. It is very pretty. It has the leather feel. Open. Oh wow! I like the design. A very nice color. Oh wow! I like it. I like gifts. And also, they give you a six-five ml brush cleaner. Yes. Just like this. And let's open this one. I think this time for this set of a brush is very good value for money. You are not only getting a full set of uh, brushes, they also give you additional sets for eyes. If I remember it correctly, let me just quickly open. Oh wow, look at this. It comes with a lovely brush holder as well. Oh. Am I imagining this? This is actually an empty one. I'm sure I bought a set of brush, then they gave you another set of brush. Mm. Maybe it's a different brand. I bought two. Uh, I bought two brands of brushes set. So we 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 will find out. But this is definitely handy to put on your desk. If you want, let me just. Put them on my desk just to look a little bit tidy because uh, as you don't see off the camera my table is all over the places has everything lined up in here so um i try to make a little bit tidier okay as we are on brushes let me find the other set i bought okay it is from hua yang beauty tools I can't remember which one's which, but there are two sets of it. One is look like this, and the other one is like this. I'm sure this is the one I was talking about that you purchased one set, then because it was on promotion, therefore they give you a free set of eye brushes. Let me just open and have a look. And this is also their free gift. Is the travel bag for carrying eye uh, brushes. Oh, look at that. that. Is again leather feel. And having the strip here, you open like that. Then you can put your uh, brushes in there. Hmm. Nice, nice. Oh, once you open, they do have another bag. Here, oh, something just dropped. What's this? I don't know what this. It just says, "Nice to meet you," and please give us a five star. I try it. If it's worth it, I will. And then this is another one. Um, that's what it look like inside. It will all comes handy when you travel. Okay, understand it like this. 
and let's just have a look as well. Yeah, I'm going to open the biggest one just to compare with the last. Oh, it's a nice feel. It's like uh, you know, if you like stroke a cat. Oh, this is the feeling. It is. It is very fine, soft. No, no fallout. No loose ones. Let me just compare with the other one. So this was the one on the other brand, Amortos. This is, seems the shape is a little bit bigger, like a fan, and this one is more pointed. You probably can tell the difference, but the feel. is kind of the same it's the same i like to try new things i'm very excited okay that's open the other one hopefully my memory didn't let me down it is the other set of eye brush Is this seems another full set of brushes? Am I going mental? Am I going mental? Never mind. Never mind. This this is for free. So this this additional set was um, was sent for free as they were doing promotion. So you. You buy one set and get one free, but but it said was the set of eye eyes brushes. But I don't mind. I don't mind the feel. Again, very soft, no fallout, good quality. But looking at it, as we were talking about Immortals uh, Beauty Sponge uh, that I've used before, and this time I purchased another set of it. Just quickly open this. It is very nice packaging. It is the gift set. And that's the inside. Look how cute it is. So you have a small like a uh, uh, stand to put these sponges in. Then you have a three sponges here. And they are in different shape, so for different purposes, one is more like a triangle. Look, the other one is uh, more, you know, traditional shape like a, a real techniques one. Have a flat top, and this one you have more cut at the angle. Have a smaller here, big cut here and here to use in the different area of your face. I like their sponges, so it's, it's very cost effective. And compared to Beauty Blender, it is slightly harder than Beauty Blender. I would say Beauty Blender is still softer. Um, but again, you know, this one is way much cheaper and is blending out foundations very well. And in here, a very cute thing is come with a foundation brush as well as this little thing. So it's like a box. That's a... How to open this box? Come on. Are you just. Oh, that's it. Yeah, so it's like a little box having small holes at the back to get the air through that. Um, so it's safer for you to travel with a sponge, keep it hygiene. How cute it is! Let's move on to face masks. I bought um I bought the cans 27 key to skin uh, face masks. It was very high rated uh, on their website and it says 
it has a genuine gold in there good for anti-wrinkle intensive firming as well so uh, I will again you know with those things you've got to try and the next one is uh, tea match tea match tea match is their highlight shadow brush tea match Uh, this one, oh yeah, this is one of the gifts because I bought their uh, light and the shadow blending palette like that. That's the bag. Let's open this one. This one uh, come with gifts as well. One was the highlighting brush. Highlight shadow, highlight shadow brush. They also give you a highlighting brush, additional one for free. This one, mm, you know, the hair is not that even, so probably as a gift, it's fine. And this is a contour brush, especially for nose and eyes. It's a gift from them as well. Um, this one seems quite soft. Let me open the brush as we're on the brush now. Oh wow, look at this, it's very pretty, it's very uh, nice shaped brush body, oh but my one seems a little bit tilted, the head, is it purposely like this or is it designed like this or my one just a faulty one? It, it's designed like this. Why? It's because here it has that angle on top which will have this brush pointed. Is it for highlights? We will see. We shall see. I am wowed by the packaging I love this color it is not Tiffany blue but in that range it's like a soft blue little bit green in there and very very pretty and it has the golden line in the middle and it has the T brand here see inside oh wow that's the palette wow it is very very pretty uh, let's see the let's see the color uh, ooh. the powder is very very fine it's really fine it is not that high pigment, which is good, especially for beginners. You don't want to, especially your contour powder, that that high pigment. So you, it's not that easy to make mistakes. This contour color, you can't really see that much. It, it is natural color, but it's very light in a way. So you probably have to um, apply quite a bit. You wanted to get the show on your face. So this is the contour color and this is the matte white powder in there to highlight under your eye area and the T point as well. And this is the highlight in there. Highlighting color. The highlighting color is uh, it's a very gentle soft golden sheen uh, it's not glittery at all I think it it would look nice you know what uh, although I had it well I had the highlight so on so we'll try the next one okay the next two are the face towers um, as 
I so I need to sometimes recording more than one or two videos. So I will need to remove my makeup, then wash my face, then redo all the routine again. So I find it is much. And easier and more convenient to use a face towel instead. Uh, same time is to protect your skin a little bit better because at the same time you don't want to uh, harshly wash your face every time. So this type of face towel is more convenient and easier to use. Um, and also much more hygiene as well because uh, you're not reusing them and every time it's a fresh one. This is the brand I, I've used them many times already. They are very good from brand called ITO. Yes, I think it's their brand. Yes, ITO here. Yeah. Uh, the other face tower is the new one I'm going to try is from one of the brushes brand which I've showed earlier, Hua Yang. So this one is you just open in the middle and take out as tissue. Guys, be patient, not too many to go. Next one is, uh, uh, let's see, let's talk about this one first. It's a um, foot mask. <laughs> Don't feel weird. Ladies, you need to look after yourself everywhere and every single thing on your body. Uh, this is from, I'm, I'm, I'm just trying to find out the brand name and all, most importantly, is how to pronounce them because some of them as it, you know if it's Asian brand so they may have the translation of their uh, Chinese or Asian names directly into English so the pronunciation may not be the same I'm just gonna use their Chinese name and this brand is called Xi. It is a Chinese brand, uh, never tried this, and uh, it is good for removing dead skin on your feet to make it more smoother and moisturize your skin as well. So, next one is a eye cream, repaired eye cream. Um, because since I start doing YouTube videos, I've been, you know, um, removing makeup and washing my face way more often than before. So although I am still a normal to oil skin, uh, but I find my under eye area is getting dry every single time. And sometimes I find with the foundations that I've used a million times and start creasing under my eye area. So I'm going to try out different eye creams just to see which one can, you know, uh, hydrate and moisturize my eye area better. So I will let you know. This one is from the brand Focus. No, that's not their brand name. Their brand name is called, I don't think they have an English name. It is called Mo Zhao Zhen Repairing Eye Cream. We'll try for a bit, then let you guys know. Uh, next one is a setting spray. Um, I mentioned on my last the favorite videos before it is this one as you can see only this much I got left it is from their um, same brand but this one is more for um, shine uh, finish and this I think is uh, it is from same brand but it is more a matte finish setting spray look at the bottle compared to this one why is a see-through why is more matte finish so you can tell the difference and this one there is no uh, I don't think you need to shake as there is no powder or anything sit inside and let's just try it ah. the mist is fine as well hmm it's a nice smell and a few more to go uh, one is a Canmake's blush. Canmake is well known in, in here in Asia. Um, this is their uh, sorry blush. I try to find the name for it. It just says Glow Fluff Cheeks. 
doesn't say the actual name of it. I'm quite interested in this color because it's more brown, plum type of color. Let me show you. Let's do a quick swatches. I just going I normally just mix all of them together. It is a very nice color. It is has a um, brown tone in there, so it would work very well for uh, winter, autumn time. Next one is an interesting product that I've never tried before. It is from Ipsa and the Time Reset Day Essence Stick. So apparently, apparently this is a essence as is described there, but in a stick formulation. So it's promoting a quick applying on your face, moisturize your face and they're ready to go. So if it works as it says, it would be very handy and friendly for people like us making a lot of videos that removing makeups and reapply everything in one day. Let me just try. Oh, oh. I haven't pressed too hard and it's already kind of um, melted a little bit. But at the same time, oh, you do feel very, very buttery and moisturized and it's not sticky, which I like, bit, but the stick itself is very, very soft. So you, you, you got to be gentle. I thought that was. And next one is a contour palette. As I'm a queen of contouring, I like to try any contour product. And this is from the brand Judy Dore. Oh, see how cute it is. <laughs> Let's open inside. That's the contour look like. Uh, I think it is my style, so it's not too warm or too cool. I will swatch both color. Okay, this one is slightly lighter color and this one is darker one and this is you blend two of them together. Personally, I feel it's very good. Um, First impression, I think it would definitely suit uh, Oriental Asian skin tone for sure. Um, I think it would work better to contour your nose and eyes. For face, I need to try and then let you guys know. Finally, you'll be happy to hear this. Now I only got the last one to open. It is a, a lipstick duo from Physicians Formula. Come on, camera. Focus. Yes. Let me just open this one. You can't actually open from one side. You have to open. Ha! Huh, look! How cute it is. Uh, they are the same color. One cream. It's just one creamy and one matte finish. And it uh, has color. I try to find the English name for the color, but seems not seeing it. Anyway, I will tell you what's the Chinese uh, color name for it. It's called Hong Dou Yi Mi Shui. So it's like a red bean soup. Do you know red bean? Yes. It's red bean mixed with Yi Mi. The color is interesting. So let's see. Ah, it's a nice brown orange tone, which is my cup of tea. Oh, I would prefer the matte one. Okay, this is matte and this is the creamy finish. The matte one, you can tell, is much smoother and the color is even. But when you see the creamy one, you do have a little bit of patches here uneven patches here. 
Do you wanna see me try it on my lip? Well, I'm going to try it. Just zoom you in a little bit. I see it is a very long video already, so I'm just going to try the matte one to see. Mm. It's very silky. It's very, very light on your lip. I really like this one. It is very, it is very comfortable to sit on your lip. It doesn't dry, crispy dry at all. And it is, let me just sit, let me look. Let me just look a little bit closer. And, and it doesn't sink between the lines. Very, very nice color. It's brown orange tone. Very suitable for autumn, winter time. And it's natural color you can use on day-to-day -day basis for everyday natural makeup look. So for so good. So finally, we have finished the everything. Uh, nothing in there anymore. So thank you so much for watching and thank you for patiently finishing the entire video. Hope you also enjoy your cup of tea and the snacks as well. And uh, if you like today's video, please give me a thumb up and most importantly to subscribe my channel. I will see you on my next one.